Hey everybody, I decided to do a video where I'm standing up, moving around today. Hey everybody, it's your girl Frankie. Got my little summer dress on. Oh, it's getting warmer. It's not summer yet officially, but it's about to be. It's, woo, it's hot out there. It's gonna be like 85 degrees today, 90 tomorrow. So pretty much enjoying this weather, enjoying this nice day. I got out early, did some walking. I am starting a new regiment where I'm going to be moving around, um, working out more. That's my thing. Should I have done it in June? Probably. Tell my summer body ready. But I'm proud of my body regardless. And I'm going to do what I do when I do it. I want y'all to have more confidence when you go outside. This is for my creators and my filmmakers. I am trying to invest in that new DJI camera, but until then, I'm going to be using the equipment that I already currently have to shoot my short films. And I want to tell y'all the process that I went to to shoot a short film. <laughs> um, yeah, it didn't come out the greatest because I'll tell y'all the pros and cons of what I did and what I should have done to make it better. But um, yeah, let's go over that. So when you... One of the first things you gotta do when you are just going out to have create your own project, even if it's not a big major thing, and you just wanna film, you can use your friends or you can go on like social media groups and find some actors that wanna build up their portfolio and don't mind working for free unless you have like the budget to pay them. But usually find some projects and just building up your resume should be shouldn't be too costly, honestly, because you are just showing off your skills that you can do. And I'm telling you, once you build up that audience, people are going to work. work. <laughs> once you build up that audience, people are going to want to work with you just because. Like, oh, oh, you I didn't know you can do that. The point of this and for the summer is to put yourself out there and start doing what you want to do now, not later. You can do that now. Um, I went to a Facebook group and I found some people and um, well, I actually used one of my friends. I used one of my friends and I needed another actor and I literally just found the location outside and did it for free. The location I chose to use outside was movie theater. <laughs> um, it, it's free. It's a public domain type thing. Only thing you're really doing is being on the outside. Being on the sidewalk, you can perfectly, as long as you're not in anyone's way and you're not disturbing the peace or anything, it is perfectly legal <laughs> and free to film outside a movie theater. So that's why I want to have a scene at. It is just a scene of a couple that was casually dating and decided that it you know, wasn't working out because they don't you know get along that well. It's a very basic script. It's like two pages at the most it's not a super long script i didn't want to have people memorizing a lot something that i'm doing just on the spot but i do want to tell y'all when you are just doing these fun projects you still have to be prepared and your girl did not check the weather fully it wasn't like it was a little chilly that day but it was windy and the audio is not that great <laughs> um it's not that great but I'm still gonna show it to y'all anyway. Did you at least like the movie? Okay. So what do you want to do now? You want to like go kick it? You want to go get something to eat? No. No, I'm going to just take it home. Let's see what you want to do something. Why did you do that? I've been trying to find the best time to tell you this, but I don't want to do this anymore. I 
didn't even want to come to the movies with you, to be honest. The only reason I came down here is because I wanted our last encounter to be kind of nice. You're more into me than I am into you. I tried to find feelings for you, but I don't see myself being with you long term. Hey, what? Why did you do this to me in public? What the fuck did I ever do to you for you to do this to me? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Mean. What does this, this mean? Little shoulder shrugs. God. Damn. What a waste of time. Um, you know, if you don't want to go to the movies, but you don't come to the movies, and you think that I'm more into you than you are up to me, that is the fucking funniest thing I have ever heard. Uh, you're clearly extremely full of yourself. And I just want to take a moment and be very honest with you, right? Because we're being direct with each other. You were a rebound. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. And then, oh, just so easy. It was sweet, right? Just lay that right on up. This is what I'm talking about. You have a temper. If I was a rebound, then this should be a fair trade. Neither one of us has to pretend or force anything anymore. Ooh, pretend and force anything and it's a fair trade. You know what, I clearly touched a fucking with you. Um, dude, just do us both a favor and get the fuck out of here. Just, just, just scat. Just go like the little baby man you are. Yeah, you're a baby okay. man. Wow. Yeah, okay, you're a baby. Grow up. <laughs> <laughs>